Welcome to the Sports Talk with T. In this video, I'm going to be talking about if the Knicks should trade Cam Reddish and why I don't think they should trade Cam Reddish, what I think Cam Reddish brings to the team. Cam Reddish can play some pretty good defense, and we definitely need that in a wing defender right now because, to me, Evan Fournier is not a true wing. He's a shooting guard. Um, he cannot defend any wings pretty good. I mean, he can't defend wings well at all. You know, he struggles against defending wings. When you look at what Cam Reddish can bring to this team, he can bring spacing because he has he has the ability to knock down the corner three. He has the ability to play defense, and I think he's our only true wing on this team. So looking at you know what he could offer to this team, he can offer a lot. We must keep Cam Reddish. They must keep him because he's the, like I said, he's the only true wing on this team. To me, R.J. Barrett, you know, even though he plays the wing position pretty well, he defends the wing position really well. Um, is not a true, you know, small forward. That's what Cam Reddish is. He's a true small forward. I think if, you know, we look at some lineups, you know, I've talked about Grimes starting, and that's certainly going to happen, I think. But in some other lineups, we can mix it up and have Brunson at the point, um, Barrett at the at the two, Reddish at the three. And I, I would really like that lineup. I just – Cam Reddish, to me, he hasn't – he has a – He's really talented, and he hasn't shown – I don't. to me, he hasn't shown his best of his game yet. I think he could really have a breakout year um, if he's given the trust. That was his problem here last year was gaining the trust of Tom Thibodeau. He had problems getting playing time in Atlanta because they had a lot of wings. Um, the Knicks do not have a lot of wings. Like I said, we have a shortage of wings right now because – Evan Fournier, not a true wing. R.J. Barrett, not necessarily a true wing, even though, he, like I said, he plays the position very well. Um, Cam Reddish can can bring a lot to this team. Like I said, on the defensive side of the ball, you know, he can guard pretty much any wing. You know, I I, I would feel confident putting Cam Reddish up against a guy like uh, Kevin Durant, you know, a guy like a Luka Doncic, because, the, you know, the, the athleticism is there for Cam Reddish. Cam Reddish was at the Summer League game a couple days ago, and he looked like he's been working out all offseason. Looks like he's ready to roll this season, and I, I just don't think the Knicks should trade him. You just traded a first-round pick for him, you know, back in, was it January? Back in January, you traded a first-round pick for Cam Reddish. To me, you can't turn around six months later and decide to trade him because to me, his value is going to decrease a little bit. You know, he didn't show much in the blue and orange last year, which I talk about a lot. But I still think the the potential is definitely there with Cam Reddish. Look, he's like I said, he's still yet to show his best abilities in the NBA. And I think it, it would be a mistake if the Knicks traded him. I think he would go somewhere and thrive. And it, why not just have him thrive on the Knicks? Well, you know talk about rotations and trying to find room for him in the lineup why don't we just trade a guy like Evan Fournier then you're able to find Cam Reddish all types of room in the lineups you know whether that's coming off the bench and you have Grimes starting Cam Reddish can still play 20 something minutes a night even coming off the bench but you know I could see him starting like I said I could see lineups changing over the over the course of the year as you know of course like they did last year um and Cam Reddish could be one of those guys that we insert into the lineup and see how that works. I think it would work good with the spacing. Like I said, he's a good corner three-point shooter. Not necessarily a good overall three-point shooter from around the floor, but when you look at his corner numbers, pretty good. So I think the Knicks should not trade Cam Reddish. Leave your thoughts on the comments down below. If the Knicks should trade him, keep him, start him, bench him. What, what, what would you like to see happen to Cam Reddish in the blue and orange? I think they should hold on to him, start him situationally, and definitely have him in the rotation on a nightly basis. I think he can bring a lot to the team. And as I always say, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, please like, comment, and subscribe.